if you're taking the Six Sigma Green Belt exam, here are all the resources that I've personally researched, which will help you earn your Six Sigma Green Belt certification. Now, if you're not familiar with it, the Six Sigma Green Belt exam is offered by the American Society of Quality, and it only requires three years of experience of on-the-job experience in at least one area that's found within the Six Sigma Green Belt body of knowledge. For example, that could be in the basics of project management, understanding the voice of the customer and requirements, performing process analysis, or even using lean tools, just to name a few. Now, as we go through this video, all resources that I'm referring to will be linked in the description bar down below. So before we get started, join me in the comments below. Do you guys plan on taking the Six Sigma Green Belt certification? Love to hear your guys' thoughts and your plans with Six Sigma. The Six Sigma Green Belt certification is really intended if you're trying to get roles in operations, business excellence, manufacturing, and areas that are tied to quality. So for example, some roles that you might see could be for a business analyst position, a program manager role for manufacturing projects, senior project manager roles for business excellence, a supervisor or a manager type position in operations, supply chain, quality assurance, or even planning. And sometimes a certification in Six Sigma will be listed as optional or desirable on different job postings. So again, based on where you see your career growing, and if you're trying to move in one of these fields that I just mentioned, it's going to be very helpful if you pursue at a very bare minimum this Six Sigma Green Belt certification. And then as you gain more and more years of experience, then you can advance and pursue the more advanced Six Sigma Black Belt certification. So let's talk about the courses that you can use to prepare for this certification. To get up to speed quickly with Six Sigma, I personally recommend using Coursera's Six Sigma Green Belt Specialization. It's broken up into four courses. The first course is at the organizational level, where you're going to learn a lot about the lean principles, design for Six Sigma, voice of the customer, and project management basics and planning tools. The second course dives into the defined and measure phases of the DMAIC process. So it's going to be here that you're going to learn about what's process analysis, what are the concepts that pertain to probability and statistics, measurement system analysis, and process capabilities. The third course is the one that dives into the analysis phase, and you'll get a comprehensive overview about hypothesis testing and design of experiments. And the final last course here gives you an overview of the improve and control phase of the MIG. There's different video lessons from Coursera that cover root cause analysis, lean tools, and statistical process control. It's worth mentioning that you can audit the course and you can go through all of the video lessons completely for free. That way, you can save that money towards your actual exam prep books and use it for paying the actual certification exam fee through the American Society of Quality. Now, on the other hand, if budget is not an issue, then I recommend investing into the Coursera Plus platform, which you can check out using the links down below so you'll get access to this specialization along with so many other certifications that you can add to your resume. Now, if you decide not to use Coursera, then the other affordable option is to invest into a course using the Udemy platform. When I did a quick search on Udemy for a Six Sigma Green Belt course, I found these two, which seem to have the highest rating on the Udemy platform. The first one is by Six Sigma Academy Amsterdam, and it contains over seven hours, giving a very comprehensive overview into each phase of the DMAIC process, and it'll give you a high level understanding of each concept. The second highly ranked Six Sigma Greenbelt course that I saw on Udemy is by Advanced Innovation Group Pro Excellence. This one has over 16 hours of video lessons, and it seems to be very in-depth, covering a lot of material and concepts that would be covered on your exam. So if you choose any of these courses from Udemy or Coursera, you can't go wrong and they'll definitely help you pass your exam. Now, before we talk about which exam prep books that I recommend, be sure to smash the like button so I know that you like and appreciate my content. Now, in terms of exam prep books to help you become Six Sigma Greenbelt certified, the American Society of Quality website recommends 
two books, the ASQ Certified Six Sigma Greenbelt Handbook and the ASQ Study Guide. The handbook is exactly what it sounds like. It has over 600 pages and it contains literally every single concept that's covered on your Six Sigma exam. It'll be a good reference aid when you're studying and also something that you can look back to when you're using those concepts in your day job. The ASQ study guide, on the other hand, is designed to help you test your knowledge and practice questions across all of the domains of the body of knowledge that would be on your Six Sigma Green Belt exam. The only other book that I would add personally to this list, which I actually still have a copy of, is the Lean Six Sigma Pocket Toolbook. It's a very handy, quick reference book that gives quick summaries and formulas for all things that are related to Six Sigma. It's extremely easy to sift through and find the information that you're looking for. So if you're only looking for a quick summary of all things tied to Six Sigma, this book is the go-to that I personally recommend. Now, if you're really serious about Six Sigma and you're actually applying it and you're using it in your day job, because let's say you're leading process improvement teams and projects, then the book which I own and which I absolutely recommend is called The Six Sigma Way Team Field Book. The authors walk you through step-by-step step each of the different phases in the DMAIC cycles with real life examples. If you're having a tough time understanding how to actually apply the Six Sigma tools to real life scenarios, this is the book that I own and which I absolutely 100% recommend to you. By the way, if you're getting value out of this video, don't forget to smash that like button. Now for practicing questions on a daily basis, the one that I absolutely recommend using is called Pocket Prep. I've personally used this to pass my own project management certification exams and it's been my go-to resource for practicing study questions. For the Six Sigma Green Belt exam, Pocket Prep actually contains 1,000 study questions across the six different domains. So the organization itself and all the different phases in DMAIC. What I love the most about Pocket Prep is how robust their question database is and the numerous features that it has to test yourself with. Now what I love the most about Pocket Prep is how robust their question database Bases and the numerous features that it has to test yourself with. Every single day, it delivers a question of the day for you to test yourself on. Throughout your workday, you can then do a quick 10 quiz or even a build your own quiz where you focus specifically on certain areas from the exam. Other great features about Pocket Prep are that you can focus and directly hone in on your weaknesses by testing yourself with a weakest subject quiz or a missed questions quiz. In terms of pricing, I recommend signing up to their subscription offer. That way you get access to their full 1000 question bank. So at the time of this recording, it's a little over $20, which is extremely affordable. That way you can test yourself every single day with their entire quiz bowl and you can hone in directly on your strengths and weaknesses. Pocket Prep, in my opinion, is an amazing tool that I have personally used and it makes it really easy to practice questions during your workday. So if that's something you're interested in, don't forget to sign up to Pocket Prep using the link that I shared in the description bar down below. So from my research, these are all the resources that should be more than enough to help you prepare and pass your Six Sigma Green Belt certification. Now, if you're trying to decide if Coursera is truly worth it or not for your career growth, watch this video next so you can learn the exact roadmap that I personally recommend so you can make the best use of your investment. And I'll see you in the next video.